Now here's a movie that doesn't understand how a lot of things work. Love, marriage, compassion, heart transplants, editing. Hi, I'm Pratiksha Mishra and you're listening to my review of Animal. Now going into Animal, I went in with certain expectations. They were all met and none of them were very great expectations. Sandeep Reddy Wanga's latest Animal stars Ranbir Kapoor in the lead as this one guy who essentially just has gone through a lot in life because his father doesn't love him. Now he's in this abusive relationship with his father but that has kind of become this thing where he will do anything wo kuch bhi kar jayega apne papa ke approval ke liye do we kind of question ki what happened to the fact that he was raised by what seems like a loving mother and two sisters no we don't because ye hai nahi wo story this is not the story where women are important this is a story about these two men and how their relationship affects everyone around them and how this one guy makes just this abusive relationship that he has with his father everyone's problem ranbir kapoor plays the character of ran vijay and his father balbir is played by anil kapoor ranbir kapoor is introduced as superstar ranbir kapoor in this film and it's absolutely valid and animal the charisma that he has the raw magnetism that he has the toxic masculinity that his character has all of it is reflected so so well with the sheer force that is ranbir kapoor in this film this could have been a film that is like a superstar vehicle but again this is not that film ranbir kapoor however absolutely exemplary he is going to get so many praises for this role everyone's going to appreciate him i feel like ye aisa ek role tha jahan pe nobody can look at it and go oh he did a bad job it was that picture perfect anil kapoor as his father also does a phenomenal job koi bhi agar emotions ho from like anger to disappointment to sadness happiness he conveys through simple subtlety just a eyebrow raise ho gaya ho ya just in the way his eyes open in a certain place or certain moment for that reason the first half at least is pretty engaging hamare jo do main lead characters hain is film may have done such a great job that you're kind of invested in what's happening the premise is also very interesting to kind of explore the idea of masculinity through this kind of fractured bond between a father and a son but ye jo puri story hai you kind of realize towards the end was very flimsy ki On paper it's a lot but in the film it doesn't translate to much of anything. First half mein theek hai you're kind of swayed by the action sequences that are very well mounted to their credit. Um just like Ranbir Kapoor's star power, the romance angle also to a certain extent if you leave like the violent misogyny aside which you shouldn't but just in case. But second half mein there is nothing. The film unravels so rapidly in the second half. Second half mein kuch kuch scenes the where I heard someone in the audience just go wow bro <laughs> and that is honestly how I felt in so many scenes just the character is saying things completely unironically where you're like wow bhai wow matlab <laughs> hypocrisy ki bhi seema hoti hai Ran Vijay at one point when he's wooing the woman that he likes goes to her and says that oh you have broad hips i think which means that she can accommodate healthy children and this line works This line works. She actually says, "Oh yeah, what kya line mara hai? This is the man that I want to marry." Sure. To Vanga's credit, I guess he does give his female character in this film more agency than he did say in Kabir Singh, but that agency is also very superficial. When you talk of like, okay, it's not like there is no space in content for toxic relationships or to explore how relationships can be abusive, how marriages can be imperfect, how love stories aren't always all, you know, just rosy tinted glasses. but here it feels like they're on their side like they're glorifying this behavior i have seen a lot of people say that oh these are characters they have flaws sure but flaws when they're glorified are not exactly how they should come across in films gray characters are amazing but the point of gray characters is to kind of have an insight into human nature to criticize what makes them gray par yahan pe we see a gray character and we're meant to root for him because uska antagonist usse bhi bada gray hai gray kya matlab it's like okay there's a lesser of two evils is what we're rooting for the antagonist that we have here played by bobby deol who i don't know why he's in the story i know why he's in the film he's done a great job as an actor but wo फिल्म वो वाला एंगल क्यों लेती है स्टिल आई एम नॉट एबल टू अंडरस्टैंड बट चलो ठीक है ही इज द एंटेगनिस्ट एंड ही इज जस्ट एसेंशियली प्रेजेंटेड एज अ मच मोर ओवर्टली वर्स वर्जन बट दोनों आर कट फ्रॉम द सेम क्लॉथ ओनली लेट्स इग्नोर दैट फॉर अ मोमेंट लेट्स गो टू द टेक्निकलिटीज The film is edited rather shabbily. Sometimes it feels like you're watching a scene before it ends it cuts to something else and you're not sure why that scene is following this scene and that also makes the experience a little jarring. 
टू बी फेयर द बैकग्राउंड स्कोर इन द फिल्म इज वेरी इफेक्टिव बहुत ही मासी बैकग्राउंड स्कोर है इस फिल्म का द सॉन्ग ऑल्सो कॉम्प्लीमेंट द फिल्म प्रिटी वेल दर नेवर स्टैंडिंग आउट एज सच बट बियॉन्ड दैट तुम देखने के आए हो फिल्म में दैट डजेंट हैपन आई फील लाइक एनिमल फॉर द मोस्ट पार्ट इज अ फिल्म दैट इज एन मेड टू बी अ सिनेमेटिक एक्सपीरियंस बट मोर टू बी काइंड ऑफ लाइक अ प्रोवोकिंग एक्सपीरियंस टू बी लाइक इफ यू थॉट दिस वॉज बैड this is worse right that's what the film constantly feels like when it comes to the acting i did forget to talk about rashmika mandana i do like her as an actor but this film was just not it bahut jagah pe you can't even understand exactly what she's saying i understand that it's a heated moment but for an audience you still need to know what the character is saying right that does not happen in the scenes where she has to essentially say stand up for herself or uh, be yelling and fighting those do work out to a certain extent but otherwise it's pretty lackluster फिल्म जब तक एंड तक पहुंचती है यू रियलाइज कि सबसे इफेक्टिव जो सीन है द शो डाउन सीक्वेंस बिटवीन द फादर एंड सन इज द ओनली थिंग दैट यूर काइंड ऑफ लेफ्ट विथ इन द सेकेंड हाफ आई अंडरस्टैंड द नीड फॉर दिस जॉनरा ऑफ वायलेंट फिल्म द प्लेस फॉर इट आई पर्सनली लाइक दैम बट दिस इज जस्ट नॉट इट ओल्ड वॉय फॉर एग्जाम्पल अ फिल्म दैट दिस फिल्म ऑल्सो बोरोज एन एक्शन सीक्वेंस फ्रॉम और ओमाज वट एवर यू वॉन्ट टू कॉल इट is such an example there are films that show violence that are actually just great cinematic experiences also puri film is starts se leke end tak there is this weird fixation with the phallic just the entire time i understand this is a hyper masculine film but it goes from gimmicky to jarring like at one point they are constantly talking about sex you're like wow okay sex positivity i guess but towards the end you're like okay why are we still talking about it like that is all i have to say cuz there's just so many people who could have gotten therapy just fighting with each other and we have to watch it for close to 3 and a half hours the first half is genuinely the only thing that ties this film together but kyunki uske baad you're just kind of sitting there hoping and praying that next time ranveer kapoor gets such a action packed role or this kind of superstar vehicle it's worth the kind of act that he's putting forward there is honestly so much to unpack about animal but i don't want to drone on and on ड्रोन ऑन एंड ऑन से याद आए द रन टाइम द फिल्म कुड हैव बिन मच शॉर्टर लाइक द पॉइंट वुड हैव बिन मेड आफ्टर द इंटरवल ओनली इट्स वे टू लॉन्ग ऑफ अ फिल्म विद नॉट मच एल्स लेफ्ट फॉर इट टू से एंड एट द एंड ऑफ द डे यू कैंड ऑफ लेफ्ट वंडरिंग की यार हो क्या रहा है एंड मे बी मे बी प्रोवोकेशन इज नॉट इनफ टू मेक अ गुड फिल्म राइट एंड द वन फीलिंग दैट आई वॉज लेफ्ट विद आफ्टर वॉचिंग एनिमल वॉज दैट इट इज अ प्रिविलेज नॉट वॉचिंग द फिल्म to be able to watch violence on cinema and realize that violence like that does not affect you in your daily life is a privilege it is a privilege a lot of us don't recognize it's a privilege a lot of us don't want to question in ourselves but that privilege does exist aur wo ek bahut hi disheartening reality hai about just the society that we live in like should we honestly start questioning why we think triggering someone is such a huge accomplishment in a society where we are essentially just supposed to coexist with each other with empathy that is one thought that animal left me with purely because of the performances a super super star ranveer kapoor and some of the action sequences that i very genuinely did like even the one that was kind of inspired by vikram my rating for animal is 2 stars out of 5